let's spin this thing yeah. forward. Because if you're the Montreal Canadiens, don't you feel a measure of confidence? Certainly Shea Weber talking about we deserved better. Clearly, this was a remarkably different feel. It was the same score through two periods. It was 2-1. But on this night, and I was watching alongside you, Dano, weeks he was doing the broadcast, it felt like a really competitive game. If you're Montreal, game three, what's your mindset? Game three is, listen, we all played them here in game two. We didn't get the result we wanted. We all played them. We're now going back home to the Bell Centre. We're going to be playing in front of our fans, albeit limited capacity. Another issue. Another they challenge. will hear the 100,000. They will hear everybody outside, outside the building as well. Totally. <laughs> They'll hear the whole province yeah. uh, for sure. But one thing that they will also have, last change. Mm -hmm. Because one factor that's been prevalent in games one and two, as you just said, it showed its face again, the dominant third line led by Coleman and Goudreau, that third line for Tampa. So now I'm curious to see how Montreal de will deploy their assets here in terms of the management minutes played matchups and everything else especially is their head coach dom ducharme back behind the bench we hope so evidently he was slated to be back in game three i think lou richardson's done an amazing job but there could be some changes coming in game in game three back at the bell center that's what they have to take going forward and the positives from this game as difficult as that can be right after the game and you're going to be on your pillow and tossing and turning not sleeping as well tonight because you're going we, ha we uh, missed an opportunity here to go back home tied at one the way we played in general. But great teams, and yes, the Tampa Bay Lightning are a great team. And if you're going to slay the Dragon, totally. you almost have to play a perfect game. And you mentioned the word, and I liked it, Weeksy, off air. Situational play, recognition, puck possession, what exactly what went on with that reverse, what exactly went on when Montreal had the puck late in the second period where they just can't let those things happen. And maybe they do win this game because Tampa Bay will make you pay, and they did. The game is going so fast, but the one thing I've learned in my six years around these guys, their minds are going super fast to be able to make all the decisions they have to make in the time they have to make them.